Welcome to the Getting Started video for Mindray's revolutionary all-new portable ultrasound system, the MX7. The MX7 delivers exceptional image quality and performance. The MX7 is equipped with a gesture-controlled external display screen. This displays the power status without switching the system on. Simply wave your hand above the screen to show the power status. So let's open the MX7. The MX7 has a 15.6 inch main screen and a fully customizable 12.3 inch touchscreen to provide efficient workflow. Now we will take a look at abdominal scanning with the MX7 using the C51S. We will start by scanning the liver in B mode. Having gained a suitable intercostal view, which includes the gallbladder and the portal vein, we notice that the liver appears smooth and uniformed, which means homogeneous parenchyma in the normal liver. You can see the gallbladder clearly in the near field. We have then activated colour mode to visualise the blood flow. Our high resolution flow function can be utilised to better visualise the status of blood flow. You can now see the portal vein with good resolution and colour sensitivity with less colour overflow. Secondly, we will scan the hepatic vein in the subcostal view. The MX7 provides good uniformity of the image and penetration to see the liver and hepatic vein very clearly. We will now move to scan the kidney in the long axis view. The image has good contrast resolution to see anatomical structures of the kidney, such as the renal capsule, parenchyma and central sinus complex. With colour mode and high resolution flow activated, we can now visualise renal perfusion with good resolution, sensitivity and reduced artefact which will assist clinicians with clinical diagnosis and treatment. We can also activate pulsed wave Doppler to gain further diagnostic information. This completes the brief demonstration of abdominal scanning. Next, we will look at superficial structures using the linear probe. The MX7's trolley has three probe connectors allowing a suite of suitable probes to be connected simultaneously for comprehensive scanning. We shall start with scanning the carotid artery by quickly selecting the linear probe on the touchscreen. The IMT is neatly defined in both the near and far walls with reduced noise and clear imaging of the lumen. As is well known, cardiovascular and cerebrovascular diseases have a higher instance nowadays. The MX7 has the RIMT function for the real-time measurement of the IMT. This provides precise results for diagnostics. The RIMT function can detect up to six cardiac cycles for calculation, which helps easily evaluate risk factors. We will now add colour mode to check the blood flow status. The MX7 provides excellent hemodynamic sensitivity to detect blood flow in the carotids. 
With PW mode activated, we can use the Smart Track feature. The system will automatically adjust the PW sample volume position and size, which also automatically calculates velocity in real time. Also, we would like to show you the excellent image quality of the blood flow in the vertebral artery. When scanning the thyroid, the MX7 demonstrates excellent detailed resolution with less noise in the near field. When colour flow is added, it provides good sensitivity to detect vascular flow without colour spill. The B-mode image quality remains consistent during colour mode imaging. The MX7 can also be configured for natural touch elastography. showing the stiffness of nodules compared with the surrounding thyroid parenchyma. Very little pressure is needed as we can take advantage of the patient's breath. There is a quality indicator for compression accuracy. In addition, the ZST Plus platform can easily detect the subscapular blood flow of the thyroid. Lastly, with the linear probe, we will look at musculoskeletal imaging. You can see detailed visualisation of the median nerve fascicles. The texture of the muscles are clearly displayed. We can observe if there is bleeding between the muscles when damage to the structure occurs. It can also provide diagnostic information for neurological diseases. We use HD flow to display the blood flow between the muscles. You can see there is thrombosis in the small veins between the muscles. In this section, we will demonstrate the cardiac scanning with the MX7. Starting with the left ventricular long axis view. The ZST Plus platform provides better spatial and contrast resolution with less noise artifact for excellent cardiac performance. With the advanced B mode image processing tool HD Scope, we can focus on a specific region of interest to differentiate between tissue characteristics of varying tissue types with enhanced contrast resolution. The same applies in the short axis view. Beside B-mode imaging, we can use anatomical M-mode, which can support three sample lines simultaneously, identifying coordinated wall motion or abnormalities. Let's go to the apical four-chamber view. After obtaining an excellent quality B-mode image, the added colour mode shows excellent dynamic sensitivity enabling visualisation of blood flow. All provided by the ZST Plus platform. Tissue Doppler imaging provides additional information on the myocardial motion. 
TDI can be used alongside PW to fully demonstrate myocardial function. By using the ZST platform, the MX7 is capable of high frame rates and excellent image quality to provide a comprehensive cardiac solution. We really hope you have enjoyed this basic demonstration of the MX7 ultrasound system. With intuitive ease of use, the dual screen MX7 ultrasound system offers critical cardiac and shared service features to enable you to deliver the best patient care possible. Thank you for listening.